My colleagues, I rise today to ask for your support for Senate Resolution 138, introduced today. A resolution to memorialize the United States Congress to fully fund the United States Postal Service and protect access to mail-in voting during this COVID-19 pandemic. As all of us here know, Michiganders rely on the Postal Service for daily living. Our seniors, our small businesses, our communities, our veterans, all of us rely on the USPS. It delivers vital medication, delivers and picks up bills, income and social security checks, birthday cards from grandchildren, schoolwork for remote students, and of course, absentee ballots. Our Postal Service has been providing us with vital services for over 200 years. In fact, the Postal Clause is in our very Constitution, and the United States Postal Service is the only mail carrier. In fact, it is the only communication system we have where our privacy rights are constitutionally protected. <laughs> My colleagues, you know what else is constitutionally protected? Our right to vote, fundamental to our democracy. Anything that threatens that threatens our right to vote, threatens our country and our very way of life. Here in Michigan, many of us rely on absentee ballots in order to vote. Dismantling the post office will, in essence, dismantle the right to vote for many Michiganders. It would dismantle the right to vote right now for my mother. In this time of COVID-19, more than anything, perhaps more than any other time in history, we need the United States Postal Service. Thank you, and I would like my remarks printed in the journal.